everybody, I'm Lisa Roberry, your independent Scentsy consultant. Welcome back to my channel. Well, friends, today's video, we are going to talk about my top recommended apple scents for this fall. Now, I, I decided to do this type of video because typically when we're talking about fall, the fall season, whether it's fall scents or fall tastes or just fall in general, typically you are team apple or you are team pumpkin. And I thought this would be kind of a fun type of video to do where I'm giving you my top recommended pumpkin scents and my top recommended apple scents. So if you missed the pumpkin video, I will link it down below. I'll also put a card up here on the screen if you want to see my top recommended pumpkin scents for this fall season. So just like the pumpkin video, I am doing my top six fragrances that are currently available plus an honorable mention and it's a different honorable mention than the pumpkin video because technically it could have very well been the same but it's not so if you are like wait what go check out the video <laughs> you'll see what i mean even if you are watching this video because you are team apple check out that video and i don't know you might find a pumpkin scent that you like you can be team both i am definitely team both if i had to choose one I would choose pumpkin, but I love me a good apple scent, which is why I had to do an honorable mention as well. So let's go ahead and dive right into what I would recommend for the best apple scents this fall season. There are 23 apple scents that are currently available to purchase from Scentsy, um, but I'm going to just, like I said, narrow it down to seven technically <laughs> seven technically. Um, so we'll go ahead and did I start with my honorable mention? I think I did. I don't remember. I'm going to go ahead and start with my honorable mention and then explain why. I think I did that for the pumpkin video as well, but I have the memory of a goldfish and I can't remember. <laughs> so uh, my honorable mention for the apple fragrances is the Dumbo scent, Soar High Through the Sky. And you might be wondering, why would that be your honorable mention? And the reason being technically, technically it's not available, but while I'm recording this, this scent is actually available in the clearance section. You can't add it to club if you wind up falling in love with it because anything in the clearance section is considered discontinued and just once it sells out from the clearance section, it's not restocked. But this is a really great apple scent. I love this. This is a great all year kind of apple scent. And this is actually in my club because I do love it so much. This is so wonderful. It is definitely apple forward, but there's other fruity elements in here. There might be peach or something in here that's just adding some extra juiciness, some sweetness, but it's definitely apple forward. And I love this. There's no spice or anything to it. And don't you worry, I do have an apple spice scent in here. There are lots of different apple scents that I have here in my top recommendations. So don't you worry, there's going to be an apple scent in here for you. <laughs> even, even if you're like, oh, I don't really like apple spice scents or, you know, what? there's literally an apple scent for everyone in my little selection here. But this one, this is a great all year apple scent. So uh, if this is still currently available in the clearance section, by the time this video goes up, go and get you a bar or two because this is so dang good and you can warm it now you can warm it in the summertime anytime but it's a really really great great one so that is my honorable mention but for the rest of my my the my actual six apple recommendations number one and not in any per, this is this really is not in any particular order uh but if if i did have to order it this would be number one cider mill <laughs> and cider mill was actually my uh, my honorable mention for the pumpkin fragrances because this is apples and pumpkins and it's the perfect balance and i think that's why i love this scent so much because i can be team both with cider mill <laughs> i love it so i don't have to choose sides because it's apples and pumpkins equally with just a whisper of spice which i really really love so that is cider mill Oh, let me, should I read you the descriptions? Uh, so Cider Mill is described as brings together fresh apples, crushed pumpkin, and simmering spices for a cozy autumn treat. I totally agree with that, but if you are sensitive to spice and you don't like a lot of spice, I don't count this one out because it's honestly just a whisper. It's not, in my opinion, super heavy on the spice. It's just perfect. It really is. Okay, let me look up the Dumbo scent. 
Okay, so Dumbo, heading back here to my honorable mention, Soar High Through the Sky, which is, like I said, currently available, still there, uh, $5.60, that's US pricing from the full retail price, licensed bars are a little bit more expensive, of $7. And this is Soar High Above the Clouds, where thrills and delights abound with apple, melon, magnolia, and candied fruit. So, yes, it's so good. <laughs> and I think, because I, I love me a good apple scent, I also love melon scents. So, mm. and don't be afraid of the magnolia that's in here. This is not floral. This is definitely, definitely a fruity scent. <sighs> it's delightful. Okay, moving on to my next recommendation is Apple Spice Season. This is actually a fragrance, a part of our Harvest Bar Bundle, and it is amazing, you guys. This is actually going to go into my club. This is the perfect Apple Spice fragrance, in my opinion, because I feel like there's some added sweetness to this. You'll, you'll see, I, I actually... <laughs> I don't have any more bars of this because I went through everything that I have. So um, I, I, like I said, I am actually adding it to my club. So that way when my next club does process, I'm going to have some more of it. Um, but this is still available to order on its own as well as the uh, five bar bundle if you want. So good. So good. And what I love about this is that because apple and cinnamon sticks for me is just a little too heavy on the spice. I like it. Um, but in terms of like something that like an apple spice that I have to have, it would be this. And that's because there is an added sweetness to this that just kind of tones down the spice a little bit. That's it, it's almost like a molassesy kind of sweetness to it in addition to the apple and the spice. It's very, very similar, if not exactly the same as if you remember from our uh, villains collection, the just one bite, the evil queen, just one bite bar. This is exactly what that smells like. But this one, in my opinion, performs way better. That's so good. Apple spice season is described as baskets of juicy apple and harvest pumpkin. Could that be why I like it too? <laughs> because it's apples and pumpkins again. Stay ripe all season long with a touch of sparkling spices. Okay, but I, I, I really honest and truly, I don't pick up the pumpkin in here. I almost, like I said, it's it gives me just one bite vibes where it's like apple spices with like another added like touch of like molasses or something or brown sugar or something that just kind of tones down the spice ever so slightly. And it's just the perfect amount for me. Okay, next one is Autumn Road Trip. And this is a very different type of apple scent because it's not really apple in the forefront. It's there, but the first thing I get is almost like crisp autumn leaves. Like there is an earthy quality to it. There is a like crispness to it, if that makes sense. And then you get the sweetness of apple. And it's really good. I love this. So this is more of a fresh apple not but not like fresh apple kind of scent like fresh like earthy fresh with a little bit of apple that's really I, I love this one and this is I feel like this should be a bestseller even though it's not marked in the catalog as a bestseller I feel like it should be so uh description here autumn road trip is take a tour through crisp harvest apple just picked on Jew pear and a forest of towering silver oak so that towering silver oak is bringing in that um, that earthy quality, but it's just, it's hard to describe, but it's so, so good. Great performer too. So Autumn Road Trip had to make my list for apple fragrances. Okay, next one. <laughs> Clearly, I need to add to my club as well. Also a part of our Harvest Bar Bundle, Berry Apple Shortbread. So it's not just apple that's shining through on this one but it is bakery goodness and you know your girl hair is here for the bakery goodness and i love this it's i feel like a perfect balance between sweet berries juicy apples meets like a really sweet like pound cake kind of feel and it's so good i love it when it's warming too it is outstanding so let me get you the scent description here 
Okay, so berry apple shortbread still currently available. Fresh baked berry perfectly complements comforting vanilla blended with lemon and a pinch of clove. So technically there's no apple in here, but I will say I did verify when I did um, type in, if you type in apple into the search bar on my website or your consultant's website, um, it will give you like anything that has apple in it. I guess it's, it must be just in the title, <laughs> not in the description. Um, I might be cheating on this one. If I'm cheating on this one, then I guess this can be my honorable mention and Dumbo can be <laughs> its place. But I do actually pick up, yes, it is berry forward, but I feel like I do pick up apple in here. And I don't know if it's just like implanted in my head because of the, because of the, the name of the scent, but I feel like I do pick it up. I don't know, I love it. It's fantastic. Okay, next one. If you know me, you knew that this was going to make my apple fragrance top picks and it would be frosted cedar this was actually a new release last uh last fall and winter season and it just wowed me in fact i added it to my club because i knew i couldn't live without it so much so i added it to my monthly club because i knew i would want want it throughout the year and i have reached for it throughout the year and i've warmed it and enjoyed it throughout the year and it is just so lovely this is such a great apple scent but there's also again with like a little like earthy element to this but this it this 100 is apple forward so allow me to just read you the description so this is red delicious apple adorns towering white cedar so there is that kind of earthy element in here in a blanket of creamy vanilla it's that vanilla but i, I feel like it's almost like it's apple and another kind of almost like another mel like a melon kind of scent in here with it along with like the earthy element but so i don't i don't like necessarily pick up vanilla in this so if you don't like vanilla scents don't be turned off by this um i think the vanilla in here is just adding sweetness it really is that apple that's shining through and it's just so lovely frosted cedar had to make my list I love it. And last, but most certainly not least, is Honeycrisp Harvest. This probably doesn't surprise anyone and either because I have been warming through this scent like it is my job. It is so good. Um, I, I just, I really like this because it's just a really good tried and true, like fresh apple scent mixed with like that like orchard air or like when you can start to sense the change in the season, which is kind of like what I get from Autumn Road Trip, when you can kind of sense the change in the season, like outside, you know, in the air, I get that same kind of vibe from Autumn Road Trip as well as this, but this is more, a little more apple forward. It's really, really great. So uh, let me go ahead and read you the scent description here. So we have Honeycrisp Harvest is bountiful orchards of Honeycrisp apple and fresh pear. Do you, do you see a theme here? <laughs> it's like, it's literally like either apple and pumpkin or apple and pear. <laughs> that's literally like, that's my jam apparently. Uh, fresh pear, anticipate the harvest with hints of warm musk. It is so nice. I love it. So it had to make my list here. So I may have bent the rules a little bit with berry apple shortbread, but I'm sticking to it. If you want to count that as my honorable mention, that's totally fine. <laughs> but I figured this would be kind of a fun little thing to do since, like I said, during the fall season, people are either team apple or team pumpkin and like all of the things. So I'm team both clearly. So I figured I would give you my most recommended uh, fragrances for each category. I hope you found this kind of fun, entertaining, and if nothing else, I hope you find it helpful. Let me know down below, are you team apple or team pumpkin? And if you are team apple, which would be your favorite apple scents? I absolutely love hearing from you guys. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like this type of content. I really appreciate the love and support. If you're new, please subscribe. If you already subscribed, be sure to hit the notification bell. That way you stay up to date with all things Scentsy. Have an amazing day, you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, friends.